All right, all right, all right. Welcome back, you guys. Been a few days, hasn't it? But we're on Zon Who today in testing grounds because I want to fight it. And uh, yeah, Let's see what we got. Unfortunate gaming. Let's see if he throws a light here. He does. Go break. Can't believe that works. Oh my god, I just got hit by that. Okay. There we go. There's what I was looking for. Probably not going to do it again. Oh, he does. Okay. Yeah, I played a little bit yesterday. I uh, didn't record or anything. I just kind of hopped on because it had been like four days since I played. And uh, I just decided to uh, to hop into some testing grounds just to play a little bit. And it was a rough time, not going to lie. Ran into some good opponents and I kind of got my booty whooped a little bit. And I was like, man, that does not feel good. Let's see if I can get a deflect here. Give it to me. Okay, he doesn't. He doesn't go for light interrupts a whole lot. Yeet. Car break. Dude, I am having some stutters here, aren't I? Jeez. There's no light interrupts from this guy. Uh, that was interesting. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> uh, but yeah. So I decided to hop in testing grounds, even though I'm not on a testing grounds character, just to try to kind of get used to uh, the changes. Like, you know, I haven't fought it a whole lot, so. We're just going to go ahead and do that and see how it goes, and uh, I just kind of felt like playing some Zon here, you know? Just how I felt. Parry it. Of course, the first time. It's so bad. Ooh, nicely done. I really thought that he was going to throw that. Okay. Surprised he did that again after I deflected the last one. Oh my gosh! Dodge Ford Heavy. Yeah, you gotta love it. You gotta love the bait. Man. People get scared of that Dodge Ford Heavy feint because that bash, it's just, it's scary to get hit by it, dude. Bashes are pressure, so you can just do that. It's pretty safe. It's unguard breakable, and you might get a dodge attack out of it, so you can just bait it for free, baby. Good fight, brother. Good fight. All right, we got a new opponent, and he's gone. Well, I was gonna say, like, Every time I see a oh, every time I see a uh, Twitch streamer, I get nervous. Every time I see somebody with like a Twitch icon, but he just left immediately. That's kind of crazy. Well, all right, let's move on. All right, now we have a new opponent. It's a warlord. Let's see what we got, baby. Let's see what we got. All right, bash him right out of that. Let's let the first one fly. You guys know the drill. Light attack? Nope. Free advantage. Oh. Yeah, I told you. It's unguard breakable, man. It's unguard breakable. <laughs> it's, a, it's a good move. I really think it's a good move. Anybody that has like a, a feignable dodge forward heavy that's that's unguard breakable, like I think Yorm has one. Um, Shaolin, Zanhu. A couple characters, man. It's a, it's a really good move. That should be utilized. Oh, wow. That was an interesting option. Okay, still not pairing that. Still not pairing it. Ooh, he got broke me out of it. Well, that's the first bash he's thrown. Still just not pairing this. Got break. Fight him. Hmm. Hurry it! Finally, we got a light out of the guy, dude. He just did not want to give it to us at all. Man, he's playing very uh, patient and reserved, isn't he? I expect people to like panic sometimes. Like they just kind of panic, click light, you know, light interrupt. They just kind of let it get away from them. But no, this guy's—he's holding on to it. He is—he uh, is being careful. That's for sure. Yeet. Wow, he parried that despite me fainting. Well, I guess I haven't fainted every single one. Hit me with the light. 
Oh, missed it. Okay. No crushing counter attempts from frame advantage, dude. You gotta love it. I, I don't even have any words. I don't even know how that hit. Wow, yeah, zero crushing counters from that guy, too. He might be a new player. I think he was, like, only... I don't even... I didn't even look at it. Was he rep three? Yeah, he's rep three on Warlord, so who knows? Either way, GG's, brother. GG. All right, we got another new opponent. It's another Peacekeeper. Rep 19. Let's see, baby. Holy... Let the first one fly. Okay, probably going to deflect that, but we're going to go ahead and give it to him. Hit him with some frame advantage. Okay. Oh my gosh, he's owning me. Okay, I tried to go for the deflect on that. Dude, making good reads here. Rain advantage again. Mm. Um, wow, and he hit me out of my uh, my dodge attack there. Okay, so obviously, guy going for every single light deflect, and it actually paid off, you know? Like, I would throw some heavies, and he would his dodge attack would get around it. Funny enough, that's exactly what I just did, and uh, he hit me out of it. <laughs> so, Peacekeeper could go for every light deflect and avoid heavies and, and be able to hit you for it even on a bad read, but it looks like Zon who cannot, at least in this matchup, because I went for a light deflect, just trying to basically play it safe and do the same thing he did, um, but he just hit me right out of the thing, so what you gonna do there? He played very aggressively, though. Dude, what the heck is going on? How's it hitting me? Dude, I'm getting owned. He's gonna deflect it. And then I get timing by a GB, dude. I have no words. I literally have no words. Defeat. This is like, this is insane. I'm just, every wrong read, timing. For Honor is an interesting game. Oh my goodness. Round okay, maybe we need to play more passive. I feel like, man, I don't even know what to do. What do I do to not get like, timinged and, and stuff? Like, I'm not sure. He's being super aggressive. Like, stop it, stop it. Okay. Frame advantage? Wow. It's a good read. How does that hit me? Stop. Man, and he does a soft faint. That was a really good read, too. Man, now I'm scared to open. Dude, he's not reacting to a bash. Oh my gosh, I go for the deflect. Dude, if he beats me. Oh my gosh. Dude, this guy's reading me like a book. I'm scared to open now. Because, dude, PK really isn't hard to deal with until you get bled. But he's dealing my, with my offense very well, and he gets a dodge attack, or he gets literally any good defensive read, and then I start bleeding, and then he can just apply an insane amount of pressure. So it's like... Man. Okay. Man, I don't know why I'm dodging. Why don't I just react? Now you can apply that pressure again like I was talking about. Okay. That was good. Okay, we're just going to hit him with it. Uh, dude, every wrong... Oh, dude, it's just not going well. Oh my gosh, I can't believe that got him. That was down to the point. Wow, dude. Okay. I just got to lock in, dude. That's really all there is to it. That's really all there is to it. If I just, like, I just need to pay attention. I need to pay more attention and play a little safer. Oh, man. This is really difficult. I need to stop dodging, too. I just need to sit there and react. I'm able to react, so why don't I react? You know? Oh, that might hit him in the geyser. Oh, it does. Probably gonna throw me. Oh, he doesn't. That was really unlucky. He's probably gonna lose this now because of that. Yeah. That dodge forward heavy is completely unguard breakable. I kind of feel bad because he kind of like demolished me the first two rounds. Uh, and then, and then like we got finally get tied up. I get a really good mix in the beginning of the round there and it was like looking bad. And then the cherry on top was the guy that just happened to be on whenever I got that heavy dude. So like, uh, he very easily could have come back and won that had that guys are not been on, but 
Yeah, that sucks. What are you going to do? Good fight regardless, though, man. That guy was really hard for some reason. <laughs> All right. We gave him the rematch, man. That, that game was too close. That game was too close. We got to give him the rematch. We're just going to hit him with it. Wow, that was super delayed. There we go. There's that again. Wow, every time I do the heavy there, like, I can follow up with a light. So I could, like, easily do that. Oh, I did it again, man. Wow. We're just gonna hit him with it. Whatever. Nice. Okay, I was surprised he did a light interrupt again. Like, man, I punished him with it. Like, that's pretty much the whole reason he lost the last game is because of it. And then he gets punished heavily in the beginning of this round because of light interrupt. He does it again. Man, okay. And then also, he, people GB after my bash. Why? I can follow up with a light, can I not? Like, can I just... Okay, now he dodge attacks. For aim advantage? Couldn't recover in time, that's crazy. Man, I'm just going for deflex, what's happening. I'm not even trying to avoid the mix. That's a lot of damage. Okay. Yeah, like, I just really like... For some reason, I love Deflex on Zanhu, but it's actually hurting me. But he probably thinks I'm just trying to get away from his soft faint mix-up, but I'm really just going for the Deflect on the heavy. Like a dummy against somebody that has a soft faint GB. So that's just, like, completely on me. Uh, I just need to sit, stand my ground. I'll take a lot less damage and a lot less bleed. Okay. See if he... Goes for another light interrupt. Okay, nothing there. Three times in a row. Okay. Dude, I did it again! I just said I need to stop! I do it again! Okay. <sighs> just give me a deflect. Is he even throwing side heavies like from neutral? Like, why am I going for deflex? I, it's just like I'm not even using my brain at all. Not at all. I'm just like letting him get away with it. I'm just keep doing it, keep doing it. Okay. I'm just playing like a playing like a like a normal MM like <laughs> well, I didn't even mean to click space there. I'm just gonna hit him with it. Hmm. Wow, he paired it nice. Does it again, okay. There we go. Is he gonna dodge? Brain advantage. Go for it again. Yes, he does. And that's a wrap. Started getting a read on him there at the end of that game. I noticed he started going for heavy parries because I've been just getting into my chain for free because he hasn't been going for parries. So then that last round, he decided to mix it up and start going for him, you know, just to try to keep me out of my chain. But I caught on to it after he parried me twice and, and just decided to feign GB that last one. Wow, man. Fun PK to fight, though, I gotta say. Good fight, brother. Good fight. All right. This is going to be the last fight of the video. It might be a little short, but it's okay. It's better than getting nothing out, you know what I mean? We got a Highlander. Reworked Highlander. Let's see what we got, man. I have this from neutral. Figured he might bait it. Oh, wow. I thought he was going to faint that. I don't parry that. Nice. Oh. Okay, no crushing counters or lights from him so far. Nice read. Mm, he read that too. Nothing. Hmm. Interesting. I was unlucky. He crush encountered that too. Parry it. Nice, dude. Okay. Well played by this guy. You gotta get a read on where they're at. You know, first round on, it's an opponent you never fought before. You have no idea where they are. And it kinda looked like he might have reacted to that, so I gotta keep that in mind. And he's playing extremely uh, slow from neutral, so, you know. He's got those crushing counters. Good defensive tools coming from Highlander and high damage, so...
Gonna have to, uh, man, I don't know if I should be aggressive or passive. Like, I feel like I should just be aggressive because, like, Highlander, you know? Is, if I play passive, you just, you just got good re- Oh, kind of feel bad for that, but... There we go. Just gonna keep doing it. Mm, thought that was a light for some reason. Nope. There we go. Harry? Oh wow, he went for the dodge attack. People that dodge attack like really often, and I know I do too sometimes, um, but especially against like unblockables and stuff, it makes me feel like they can't react. Like that I feel like is kind of a giveaway sometimes. I dodge attack occasionally against unblockables um, if I don't feel like reacting though. So, so like that can be the case as well. Okay. This dodge mix-up is tearing him up. Oh, man. Nice parry. For aim advantage. Ooh, nice. He got me there. Hmm. Gonna read it twice? No, he isn't. Okay. Yeah, I will say he does play like very oddly from neutral, um, but maybe he's just like, I don't know. I don't know. It's hard to get a read on some people. Some people I fight, I just can't really get a read on, you know? Can't figure out what their game plan is. I've been running into that more and more lately. And I think that's due to like lack of practice, really. Nice parry. Figured that he was going to do that. Oh, thought I'd dodge that. Oh, now he throws a light. Interesting. Doesn't hit. Okay, so he's straight up predicting. Got it. Okay. So I should be able to just hit him with this, then. Gonna light me again? No. Okay. There we go. Mm, that gets me a lot on Islander. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, I forget he can feign it. Wow, well played, dude. Well played. I completely forgot he could feign it. Oh, man, it's going to take a while to get used to this. Um, so I just saw that, and I could differentiate between the light and the heavy there, and I was just like, oh, okay, free win. Round five. Just got ahead of myself there. Takes a while to like completely change you know, how you think about the game whenever you've been doing it for years. There we go. Nice parry. Nice. Dude, crazy. Oh my gosh, I thought he'd faint. Just light him. He almost got it. Parry? Dude, he parried it again. Oh my goodness, crazy game. Crazy games today, honestly, dude. Crazy games today. All coming down to like one read on multiple occasions. Like, dang, dude. Victory. Holy crap, he didn't faint a single kick. He didn't faint a single kick, so I thought he might save it for that last round and, and faint it, you know? So I just sat there and stared at it, and of course he doesn't faint it. He just hadn't fainted a single kick. He's like playing old Highlander. That definitely... uh that definitely was hard to get a read on, you know what I mean? Like, dang. I thought I was making a big brain read by waiting until the last round to sit still on a kick. Uh, but no, he's, he just let it fly again. Kind of interesting, dude. Anyways, we're going to wrap it up there. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please like and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one. GG, brother. GG.